In previous video, I show you how you can use the ready-made FortiGate firewall image to upload to EVENG. But in case if you want to create your own from scratch, so first thing you need to download the image from support Fortinet. So let me open support Fortinet website and from here I need to choose FortiGate and select platform. Platform we're gonna use KVM and these are the different version. The latest version is 7.2. The reason in 7.2 they put some restriction. You can only use three interfaces and blah 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 those things. So I gonna show you 7010, the earlier version. So I click on 7010, okay, for KVM. Keep in mind you need to select the platform KVM. So this is for different purpose. This is for the upgrade previous version. This is the new deployment, but for, for ARM. And this is for upgrade again, okay. And this is the new deployment of FortiGate KVM, okay. So I need to download this one and the size is almost 71 MB. So click on download and let me download this one. Okay. And let me put this on the desktop so it will be easy to access. Okay. And this is in the zip format. Okay. So let them download. Now I need to open WinSCP. Okay. And I need to log in to the Eve NG192.168.114.128. Okay, so 128, we saved last time, okay. And what I need to do, uh, yeah, so the image is download. And what I need to do the, now we need to go to the Eve NG, Kimu naming. When you log in to Eve NG, uh, .net, and if you click on Kimu image naming, and here search Fortinet. So they say the folder name has to start in small words Fortinet and after dash you can put anything and this name is uh, same for each and everything firewall, mail, manager, analyzer but the folder name has to start from Fortinet and after dash you can put anything in uppercase, lowercase, whatever and the inside file name has to be this one. So what I need to do I need to copy this Fortinet Okay, and I need to go to the OPT unit lab ads on Kimu and I need to create a new folder and let me paste the same. And after that, normally what we do, we give them this, the images analyzer. It is a, a mail or manager. So normally we put FGT. It means FortiGate firewall. And after that, we can put anything. So in this case, I will put the version. Okay, so the version is this one. Let me copy this one and let's go back and let me paste here. This normally we do. So you can uh, use uppercase as well after dash. And this is version 010. Okay, and let me put dash here as well. And M and this the build number. Okay, and set permission 77. Okay, and click OK. So this is the directory which I create. And recently we download this image. So I put on the desktop. Here is right click and let me extract this to the same folder. And here is. Now the inside file name is different. It's okay. Let me drag them then we're gonna rename them. So let me drag this image to the same folder because they say the name has to be VIR this one. Let me copy this one and let's go back is copy now and let me right click and rename either F2 and paste. So the name has to be like this and after that you can apply the fix permission command root Eve ng and now I need to apply the fix permission command. This is the fix permission command the last thing which is required. So we download the image and after that we extract them the file name was 40 ios okay we uh, open a venus cp and our eve ng and the location we went to that location the location is opt unit lab ads on kimu okay and there we create a folder with the same name 14.8 fgt and after that we put the version of the 
if, uh, the firewall image okay normally we do like this and after that we rename 40 OS to VIRTIO as per the EVE-NG documentation and after that we apply the fix permission command and now I can use this image in our lab so the latest image we can use them so let me right click here go to node and type 14x and there should be the latest version and it's here this one uh, 14 FGT version 7010 okay and can give them FG 10 let me give them and you can change the icon to anything suppose this one so that we can recognize them and click save and after save this the 40 gate latest version and click start and when it start you need to click on that and your case it can use putty or any other and my case is using secure CRT and let me open in secure CRT okay it will take some time to boot and after that you can use this image in your lab so this is the way how we can create our own image from scratch okay and you can connect them to management cloud and then you can use them in our lab the default uh, username is admin and there is no password you need to type the password two time and then after that you can use the same password so i will show you that one this is the way how you can create your own image from scratch you need to follow the documentation of eve ng it was so easy in case if you want otherwise you can use the ready-made image i will share you you just need to drag and use them straight away no need to create your own okay so let's go back it's going to start and when it start I will show you the default username is admin and you need to enter a password first time and the password can be anything whatever you like by default there is no password set on this 40 gate yes login so admin enter and new password 123 123 and that's it if you want to check get uh, system status and here is so this is the version uh, 40 get uh, virtual image 64 kvm this is the version 7010 okay and the a uh, license is valid and it will expire in 29 because by default is uh, there is uh, 14 days license i will show you how you can renew the license as well so it was so easy if you want to create your own image